GCSE Vectors Question 3. OAYB is a quadrilateral, OA is 3 little a, and OB is 6 little b. Express AB in terms of little a and little b. So let's get a route from A to B, along which we know all the vectors on the way. So we can go from A to O and O to B. So I can write AB is equal to AO plus OB. Now O to A is 3A, so A to O is minus 3a and OB is 6b so I can write that as 6b minus 3a we'll now move on to the second part of the question the second part says x is a point on AB such that AX to XB is 1 to 2 so this splits this in the ratio 1 to 2, which means that AX is one third of AB. It's been split into three parts. AX is one of them, so it's one third of AB. And we'll need that in the next part. We're told that BY along the top there is 5A minus B. And we're asked to prove that OX is two fifths of OY. So we need an expression for OX, we need an expression for OY, and then we would hope that OX is clearly two-fifths of OY. So let's first of all find OY. How do I get from O to Y? Well, routes that we know, we can go from O to B and B to Y. So OY is equal to OB plus BY. OB is simply 6B. And BY is 5A minus B. So what we've got there is 6b minus b is 5b, so we've got 5b plus 5a, which I could write as 5 lots of a plus b, or b plus a. Now I want an expression for ox. So can we get a root from o to x? Well, o to x, we can come... O to A and then A to X. So O X is equal to O to A plus A to X. And that's O A plus, and we said before that A X is one third of A B. So I can write that as one third of AB. Now I can put the vectors in. OA is just simply 3A. And then I want one third of the answer we got to the first part, which was AB. And that was 6B minus 3A. Multiply out the brackets and we get 3A. A third of 6B is 2B. And a third times minus 3a is minus 1a. I'll just write minus a. What does that come to? That comes to 3a take away a is 2a plus 2b, which is two lots of a plus b. And now we can see clearly we've got two lots of a plus b and five lots of a plus b. So ox, therefore ox, is two fifths of all y. One fifth of all y would be a plus b, so two lots of a plus b is two fifths, and that completes the question.